We got game one for a reason. We're in our own barn. We get out there. We need the first goal scored. First goal can determine this game tonight. And we need that first goal because you're going to run off momentum. You're going to run off energy. We need those fans behind us. We need to go out there and show them that we're here for them. And you're here for your teammates. And you're here for what you wear this jersey for, for the crunch. Woo! Let's get out there and get the job done, all right? Woo! Let's go, boys! Same energy, boys. Same energy. Probably one of the nicest rinks uh, I played at, and definitely fan-wise, you know, when you get a, you know, no matter how many fans are there, if you get a good amount, it, it's packed in the place, and it, it's it's more uh, loud to play it, and it's just a good atmosphere. Uh, it's awesome. I mean, I'm, I'm you know from LA area, so it's huge there, and uh, you don't you just don't get the support there. And uh, with here, everything's hockey, 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 and and if you don't, you know, you try not to burn any bridges, and everyone will always support you. So it's a it's fun to play in front of. You. You know, it's a great experience playing in a new town, a, a hockey crazy town, obviously. I uh, love the support, like the coaching staff's real great. We've got a great group of guys in the room and the fans support us all the way, so it's a good time. Oh, the rink's real nice, you know, the ice is real nice, like how many fans can fit it. The room is just great, like the facility is just beautiful, so. It's been a lot of fun for the whole organization. Uh, the fans are great in this community. we got a great facility, a, a one-stop facility here. It's, uh, it's nice to be in. And you just couldn't ask for a better atmosphere for Junior A Tier 2 hockey. Right, like uh, we just work out in the morning, on the ice, work hard. Some guys are going to work out after practice. Uh, but, you know, it's just you got to dedicate yourself all the time if you want to be the best team in the league. So, Well, beyond expectations, uh, we're ecstatic. We're really happy with the, uh, with the, the impact the boys have had in the community and with the impact the actual team has had on the community as well. I had uh, two uh, players from Colorado living in my house as billets and uh, I can tell you that uh, we've left an imprint. And these are friends for life, they're coming back. And one player has left to play for another team and still comes back and visits and uh, is telling us that they'll be coming back anyway. I know that uh, as American players, our Canadian way of life, our northern way of life has had a real impact on these guys and uh, it's, uh, it's exciting to watch. Our highlights of our program is we keep the kids focused and busy. You know what? You're here for seven, eight months a year. You're here to play hockey, dedicate yourself to get yourself in shape, becoming a, a good young man who works out every day and is focused on one dream. The dream is to be a hockey player and also to be a good student. Well, from the start of the year until everyone wrote their SATs, Coach Idoc had us in line for sure. We were every day at one. We we're in the class for an hour, practicing SATs and trying to like upgrade our scores. And for like. Off, other off-ice things, we work out every morning, so it's kind of nice. My goal is to make sure that every 20-year-old that comes to my program is going to leave here going on a scholarship, be it the NCAA or the CIS. And uh, so far this year, as our program right now, we got five full commitments to NCAA programs and one to CIS. So we're this year just alone has already been a win situation for us coming here in the playoffs. Oh, if you want to play in front of a great community and have uh, some nice fans to play for and get treated right and playing a good organization, a good hockey league in the Northern Ontario League, then this is the place to be.